do you kick butt as a kart racer? CTR, or Crash Team Racing, has been called by at least one reviewer the best kart game ever. Now it gives you even more ways to take on your friends. We asked the developers at Naughty Dog to show us why it's great, how to get the most out of it, and how you can get the inside edge that leaves your friends in the dust. When we caught up with them, they were trying to kick each other's butts at a nearby track. Naughty Dog are huge fans of the kart racing genre. Um, we're also extremely, extremely into multiplayer games, and we really wanted to bring the two of them to the PlayStation. And in America, this is the first time, actually, that it's really been done uh, for the PlayStation. So far, the press has been extremely enthusiastic about the game. I think one of the things that they're most excited about, besides the technology and the fact that the engine is so beautiful and so clean and crisp, is the fact that there are so many options. You can either do arcade mode, which is just get in and race against other cars, and you can do that one or two player. You can go versus mode, one, two, three, or four player, so you can play against your friends with a multi-tap. Um, you can go time trial mode, which is just you in the course in your best time. There's a relic race, which allows you to race around the course, and there are time boxes set out that you can hit that kind of freeze the clock for a little bit of time, so it's a little bit more strategy. There's an adventure mode where you collect gems, you collect trophies, you collect the things that uh, Crash Games are famous for giving you and go for that 100%. And then also there's a battle mode, which is kind of a totally different uh, take on the, on the racing, and you can go in with one, two, three, or four players, and, and basically there's no finish line. There's just missiles, rockets, shields. Uh, it, it's a, a match to the last last man standing, and we have a lot of options there for teams, two on two, three on one, we do a lot of different things. These two guys design the torturous tracks that are going to challenge you. We asked them what will stand out and how you can get an edge. I'm really proud about the big air. I think that the vertical gameplay in uh, this racing game is something we've never seen before in any game. And the idea of the hang time meter and trying to get big jumps and trying to get big air so that you land and you get the big turbos. Um, that we've seen people, they're just very addicted to trying to find places within the track that they can get larger jumps. Some of the other things we tried to focus on was um, giving each track a specific theme. In the sewer round, there's a half pipe that you race in, going up and down on the turns and um, and sort of catching air on the lips of the, the pipe. And then another theme level we have is the castle level, where essentially all of the turns are 90 degrees. So it's a lot of right angles that you have to navigate very quickly and sharply. A lot of uh, racing games really are about soft control, and you have to just like work really hard just to stay on the track. And we decided early on that we were going to give the player very tight control. And then within that, make the gameplay complicated so that you had to choose good lines, and you had to avoid the obstacles, and really work hard to, uh, to maximize your lap times. We've got a, a pretty sophisticated um, turbo system where the player can achieve uh, turbos through um, at least four different ways. Through a combination of using all four types of those turbos, you can, on some tracks, almost be in a constant turbo for an entire lap. One tip for being the best driver possible, you've got to uh, hit the tops of the whoop-de-doos. You'll see like a bunch of bumps coming in a row in order to, to really get off those. If you hit the back side of one, you know, you're coming in, boom, you aren't moving forward anymore because you like slam into the back of it. So if you hit it, if you can nail the top of it, you come in and you'll like, go over the top. Something really cool about this game is that you can play with friends and select from more than 12 characters, including the bad guys. And there's a new bad guy, an oxide. Here's where he came from. As we were building the space round, it just clicked. Everything fell into place. Why not an alien? Jason had the idea of four legs. Our Japanese producers had the idea of the very racer helmet-like design. Several American uh, producers had the feedback of the dreads coming out of the sides of the helmet. It was a very good mix of all the input. Before we left, we found out that the Naughty Dog developers created an exclusive download for subscribers like you. As a special thank you to PlayStation Underground viewers for all your years of playing Crash games, we have on this PlayStation Underground a secret character that can be unlocked only with the PlayStation Underground. Play it. Tease your friends. Tease your friends? Tease your friends? What could you possibly tease your friends about? CTR, 
VR. It's no ordinary racing game, but the chance to take your friends on in the ultimate battle on wheels. Good luck kicking butt.